All right, what's up my friends? Welcome, we're playing some Explorer slash Pioneer and uh, we're playing a pretty cool update to the, uh, the Waste Not deck we played a little while back. Uh, this deck 5 out of League of Magic Online and a uh, new card here is Rankle's Prank, which is a new sorcery from, uh, from Wilds of Eldraine. Point of first sorcery, choose one or more. Each player discards two, loses two, loses four, or sacks two creatures. So kind of cool. Can be like a barter and blood wrath of god effect, can be a mind rot effect, can be some life life loss also, it's shoulder, which is kind of cool. And uh just a pretty powerful card. Kind of weird, kind of hard to use, but is rather powerful. And what we have here, for those who don't know, is a discard deck based around Waste Knot, which is an enchantment that gives, gives you bonuses for your opponents discarding cards. Uh, obviously, Thoughtseize, great card in the format. Liliana of the Veil, vale, great card in the format. These are all cards that naturally discard. Uh, Go Blank's a pretty good cyborg card also. But the real draw here for Waste Knot in this deck is Gyre Reach Sanitarium. So the problem with a Waste Knot deck is that your opponent, you discard all their cards and how many cards left. They draw a card and play it and draw a card and play it and never have a card in their hand. And you draw like the rest go blank waste not and it all don't do anything so sanitarium is a way to force your opponent to discard and then also draw with shoulder which is really cool too so it's an awesome effect for the deck and uh interesting here to see maze mind tome over reckoner Bankbuster. uh but i guess the extra card and life is worth it more you don't really care about the creature that much we're, we're, we're winning the game other ways massacre is pretty cool the only difference between this deck and pioneer and explore on arena is there's no herb work on arena otherwise it's the exact same deck so nice crossover there as well so that's the deck, and let's get right to the games, brought to you by ColossApparel.shop. Best magic apparel out there, I even close, super high quality, super comfortable, great designs, up to over 50, 50 designs at this point, and we're talking t-shirts, hoodies, uh, they have hats now, my, uh, my merch is on there, my Power Driver merch, which is super great, and uh, just a lot of stuff. ColossApparel.shop, use promo code JIM10 for 10% off your order, I uh, love to run the power shirt, one of my favorites. And then I'm even not going to buy anything. Hop on over, look at the website, put a smile on your face, you know, some fun parodies, and uh, check it out, ColossApparel.shop. Again, promo code JIM, 10, 10% off your order. ColossApparel.shop. Uh, check it out. Milo Ren. No! Chat, coming out with me. We're all still doing our downloads for uh, puzzle, uh, Puzzles and Survival. I'm still hiring, of course, an assistant as well. And if you're watching on YouTube, make sure that like button. Helps a ton. Thanks so much. Hands great. Duress, Maze Mind Tome, Liliana. Perfect curve. Could be a thought season, I guess, but... The only problem here is no swamp for our two castles, but, I mean, this hand's great, so we're definitely keeping this. On the draw, Mountain. Mountain go. All right, so... Duress, yeah. Hopefully it's on all creatures. Double Embercleave? Ornithopter... Inspector reinforcements with no white. How in God's name did they keep this hand? This hand is atrocious. Still a piece of garbage. Wow. All right. Double red, no white. No way to do actual anything. Uh, the goals for puzzle and survival go till uh, Monday the thirtieth is the last day for that. All right. So they drew the white source. Uh, and then they're not casting the Inspectors, so they can cast the Enforcers. That's pretty sick, I just drew the White Source. What a sicka. Alright, sure. Um, now my Liliana's kind of bad. I'll probably just plus it. We do have our Maze Mind Tome. Also, we need to decide if we're going to scry with the Tome or not. CA, new sub, which anyway from Welcome. Alright, I mean... Got a mystery card here. Freaking goblin sleeve, I like it. You draw another land and play an inspector. All right, but they're pretty close to Embercleave while all their creatures are tiny, so that's fine, I guess. Without the Bunnicorn, the Embercleave is not very exciting. <clears throat> are we gonna scry? Is the question. Next turn is Liliana, and I guess plus, which is not great, but I guess fine. I don't think we're gonna scry. Take two. We're 20, you know, that's kind of kind of fine. You can draw four times or scry four times or any combination thereof. Once the fourth counter's on, you sacrifice it and gain four life, which is pretty good. Some intended to lot of, you want to just like scry to try to get to the get to the four life faster, maybe. Alright, let's scry. Scry one. I hate scrying. I like drawing cards, but whatever. Take a little look. We see a thought sees. Uh don't want that. 
Amber Cleave is not very threatening right now anyway. Draw another land, sure. So, not very good draws, uh, but it's okay. We'll figure it out, you know? Well, we got a plus. I think we're just gonna keep plussing and soaking damage and also making this garbage kind of cool. Field of Ruins up very good here. Um, yeah, just ship the field. Surprised they didn't draw a card response, honestly. Because their hand, it's kind of unclear what they should discard. But having another card in their hand, they have more information, would be very, very helpful. Discarding Field of Ruin, they discard Soak is on. Sure. We can't scry again. I think I'm going to wait, though. Now we have, like, literally no spells in our hand. So we should draw, we should draw cards, I think. So Liliana goes to four. They could, I guess, Ember Cleave to kill Liliana if they really want to, but that's kind of like, sure, you know, whatever, it's fine. Draw off the clue. They have Cleave, Thopter, two cards at end. Play another land, sure. We're probably going to Scry again, we'll see. Let's see how this turn plays out. We do have Castle Lockthwain also, so like, the life will be nice to, to help fuel the lock the Lockthwain. We got one coming at Liliana and two coming at me. Oh, I guess the Ember Click kills Liliana by itself, right? Because it pumps to two and then does double left strike. Yeah, that's fair. So we take, we take two here. It's fine. Old Ember Cleave. So they're going to cleave. It costs three. It takes up most of their turn, which is pretty good for us. Let's fire up a scry here. All right. So give me a scry. Go blank. Not very good here either. So, Lily's dead. We're at 16. We have Maze Mind to him. They play the Ornithopter and just say... Go more. They have a they have a thingy also. Alright, so Devolution also. So they're, they're super wide right now. And we're fishing for a shielded or something like that. So let's... Uh, page counter, draw a card. Bobby well, we scribe, he wants to draw cards. Yeah. I get those draws. I draw waste on. Not ideal. Alright, so unfortunately, this game has gone about as bad as possible. You've drawn essentially only lands. Um, we are getting four life next turn. Which is good, I guess. They have no cards in hand for waste not just yet. Not a very good matchup for waste not, obviously, because they're just empty handed almost all the time, but. I think at this point, we need to draw a removal spell of some kind. There's an Epicure. Take one. Sure. Medic Mask would be nice to have one of those. Shoulders Edict, not as nice. Um, <clears throat> so we're going to draw and gain some life. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine damage available. So we're still alive. Either way. So let's draw a card. Gain four and find a Heartless Act. Very, very good draw. That's excellent for us. So now I can kill the Inspector. I only take three, four, five, six. And probably still in trouble, but what are we drawing to? Like we have one massacre, three shieldred. Not on our main deck here, as far as like instant decks that are going really wide like this. We're playing Explorer, which is Pioneer, so no digital only, no no digital uh, edits. These are all the real Magic cards. Just playing Pioneer, basically. I long for the day when I can stop saying Explorer, having to explain it, and just I can just say we're just playing Pioneer on Arena. Hopefully soon. Alright, so... You're gone. Take six damage. I'm a huge fan of Historic. I think the digital cards are fun. Uh, but having to explain the difference is kind of annoying. Buffs and nerfs, I'm not, not really a fan of, but I do love, do love digital cards. I do love Historic as well. But the buffs and nerfs paper cards are just too jarring, I think. Liked them at first, but it's just too much. Right. Let me draw a Fatal Push. We have an Edict and a Push here. So we can actually go... Ugh. We're like just dead here, like a bunch of different ways. Uh, so we have... We can animate the Hive and block and then push something. We still take four... Or we can Edict and push and still take four also. Yeah. Yeah, we're dead. All right, we got us. Pretty awkward game, obviously. We drew pretty horribly. And uh, 
they drew out of their completely unkeepable hand. Remember, that game they kept no white sources, double Embercleave, you know? But now we're bringing Second Massacre, bringing Extinction Events, bringing Path of Peril, bringing Ray of Enfeeblement, probably, and we're in much better shape. Cut the Duresses. Uh, honestly, a lot of our discard stuff is just bad against them because they're, they're so good at being empty-handed. You might just want to board them more maybe like a mid-range deck. Although they don't really have much, they don't really have much to, like, to, uh, to cut here, honestly. The, uh, the blanks are terrible. Duresses are terrible. Could bring in Vote Despair. That's not very good against them either, honestly, though. So I guess we're just gonna, we just gotta leave in these the Waste Knots. Raven Man can't make blockers. Yeah, this is fine. Not an ideal matchup for us. We basically just need to draw Massacre or Extinction Event. Or we're kind of in big trouble. That's like kind of what their deck does, though, right? They're just like, go super wide, hope you don't have it. So... Going into game two. I think we're fine here, though. I think we'll be right. Never worried. All right. Hands great. Keep. We actually have a sanitarium this time, too, for the Waste Knot, which is cool. So, we got turn one, push your thing. Turn two, Waste Knot. Turn three, Liliana Plus. Love it. Vantage. Well, not as minus, but all of our cards are just bad against them, right? All of our discards are kind of bad against them, and then really not as bad against them, too. But, alright, so they're gonna make a thing. I'm just gonna push here. Just like, keeping them off convokes pretty important, too, so. Another waste on. Alright, so waste on number two. Let's see what we wanna do here. Um, it's probably definitely gonna be Liliana Plus, I think. And we'll see what we wanna discard. Shock and a land. Challenging matchup. Here's an inspector. Clue and a blood. Make some rectangles. Alright. Yeah, it's pretty good. No convoke. So if I hadn't killed that creature, they could they could convoke this turn. So good thing we did that. And then if I plus Liana here, it's just gonna die. Unless they discard a creature. I could also I was gonna waste not thoughtsies, I guess, right? Just like waste not thoughtsies. Then I get to get double triggers here. Take creature against some blockers. They have Reinforcements, Giant Killer, Bunnicorn. Bunnicorn is very large. Either way, we're getting two zombies here, which is pretty good. Um, there's honestly some amount of incentive to want to take the one drop to guarantee a creature in their hand next turn for Liliana, but just take the Bunnicorn, I think. Let's take this, make two two twos. And now we say go. And now like, they don't even have, have good attacks anymore, which is great for us, so... We draw a land, we can go Liliana. Let's see what they do. They play, they play the land. So they have creature, creature, and they just draw the card we thought seized. Thoughtseize bug! We draw a field of ruin. So they're gonna discard a creature to Liliana, and we're gonna get two lands. Two, two, two tokens, I mean. Then the question is do I wanna play a land and just yeah, I'm gonna play a land. We're gonna start, start, start sanitarying them too, so we don't we don't need maze my dome. So let's play this. Plus Liliana. They discard one of these. I get two two twos. And then we say go. Bunny corn can kill Liliana, but now I can start sanitary sanitary ying ying ying. You're saying it wrong. I'm, am I saying it wrong? Um and just like trigger the waste on every turn, which is kinda cool too. Just a cute little bunny, you know? A spike at demolition to make three more tokens. And then they're going to play giant guards. So they have a 9-9 Bunnicorn attacking Liliana. So this is great because like it I would have not blocked if it was a 4-4. Now it's a 9-9. It makes no difference at all. So. Alright, so Fatal Push best draw here. How about a third waste knot? Um So I Sanitarium. Each player draws the discards, and then if they discard a creature, I get zombies. If they discard a non-creature knowledge, I draw two cards. Or if they discard a land, I get a bunch of mana. Um, sure, let's do that. I'm gonna tap the, uh, I'm gonna leave Fielder Run on tap though, because if I get a bunch of mana, I can, I can field them. Let's do this. So, Sanitarium. Each player draws and discards. You draw Thoughtseize, we'll discard that. 
They discard an Imidane's Recruiter. Would have been a gross draw. Woo! What draw that would have been. All right, and then we're not going to attack. We're just going to So now we have six zombies to their uh, six, seven, eight, nine creatures. It's pretty good. And again, like I said, Sanitarium is the V card that makes Waste Not a playable card. Uh, because without Sanitarium here, we have always Waste Knots and nothing can do with them because they'll never have cards in their hand. But with the Sanitarium, you can just have this engine you can just do every turn, which is awesome. So they draw Loxodon, which is pretty good. Although size of these goblins up to two twos isn't, isn't that bad for us. So I have two twos also. They can bun a corn attack. I'll trump block. They can tap something, I suppose. It doesn't really matter that much. But And then I have... Uh, if I draw a land, I can go waste not Sanitarium again, which is kind of cool. Then we're going to tap a zombie. Oh, I guess they tap it. I can't block. Nope, doesn't work either. Why they tap that? I could still block with everything and kill this if I really wanted to. Um, that don't make no sense. Whatever, I block. Let's draw a Mater, maybe Mater Massacre. I go Swamp. All right, so we need to go Swamp, Waste Not. The problem is if they hit a land, it's really bad for us, but whatever. What am I going to do? Play Waste Not. And then as far as... Don't want to do it now. Let's do it now, right? Yeah, sure. All right, do it now. Both players draw and discard. They discard a... An Ornithopter. So three more three more zombies. Let me just say, yeah. <clears throat> A lot of math here. A lot of like figuring out, you know, when, what the right attacks are, how to alpha strike, a lot of tokens in play. And then we're just doing this sanitarium thing every turn, which is super sweet. Emidane's recruiter, by, by far the best draw on their deck for them. In the tank, they drew a cool one. All right, here comes the attack. The attack is going to be. The Inspector. All the 2-2 two -two Goblins. And the Loxodon. <clears throat> Is Bunny going to stay home? Embercleave kills us. Can't, 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 can't do anything about it. And the Bunnicorn. Alright, well, if they have Embercleave, I'll be very sad. But, alright, so we're going to make some blocks. So it's 22 damage on Bunnicorn. Yeah, I, we can't play around uh, around Embercleave. They have it, they have it. Um, I don't want to lose all my blockers. Let's just do this. If it's Happer too, though, I keep two blockers this way. All right, sure, whatever. No Embercleave, please. All right, thank God. All right, so make much trades. Um, now we're at 13. We have two blockers for Bonacorn. Probably like an end tap, end step, untap, and then tap. Draw Field of Ruin. That sucks. Alright. Uh, that's fine. So let's just do this. Each player draws and discards. If they have a land in their hand, we actually just lose here. Oh, never mind. Oh, no, we can't get past the barrel. Oh, I'm sorry. No, we can't, because they, they'll, they'll, we'll get mad after the land. So, discard this. Path of Peril is still a bit perilous, but... So discard a land! Discard a land! Discard the land, gas. Yes. Alright, so black, 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 black. <clears throat> no white here, unfortunately. We're tanking. I don't know what we're tanking for, but... Alright, so I get to cast Path of Peril, kill everything but the, the Loxodon, and I'm at 13. Hopefully, they don't have the uh, raise the alarm in their hand. Bingo. All, right. All right, you're up. Shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. Exact card I didn't want. Can't attack first. I was floating the mana, so. All right, you draw land. All right, let's just do it again, I guess. They have a land again this time. We're dead. All right. Uh, I guess we'll keep the Liliana. It's pretty awful, though. I'm going to keep it land. 
If I draw a meter massacre, it's better for next turn. Yeah, so discard this. Discard a land. God damn it. Oh, man. What a killer. Just like big ripsky from our opponent here. All right. Uh, let's just say go. We go to one here. How about we just draw a freaking meetup mask here? That'd be cool. Can I press the lightning yellow button? I have a channel point redemption point, you know. Tough. Tough game. I have the reinforcements, I'm at nine. And I have like I have like a multiple more turns to draw stuff. With the enforcements, it's ish of four damage or whatever, so we're just at one now. Keeping Lily, um, why the, yeah, I should have kept the, I should have kept the, the Lily. Yeah, I screwed up. I should have used the mana to cast Lily and then plus it. You're right. I screwed up. Um, so we're going to attack point three and then cast the Knight Errant for two. We hit Thalia and Bunnicorn. We draw Extinction Event. Um, Extinction event for five, or for, I'm sorry, odd, leaves them with two one ones, and it leaves me at one life. All right, they have Thalia and Bunnicorn. Um, hmm. It's funny, because, like, if I Sanitarium and they discard a land, I can cast Extinction Event. And if they discard a creature, I get three blockers. Hmm. Oh, I'm going to one here? Damn. This is, uh, this is something. Well, if I discard a non-creature non non-land, we just lose, but what's the purpose? Like, So I'm just chump blocking... They're going to play two more creatures. Then Thalia's awkward, too. What can I loot into that's, like, really good, though? Because the problem is, like, I don't really have much... I can draw, like, a Heartless Act or something like that, or, like, a Raven Feeblement. All right, let's just do it. Oh, Meetup Massacre! Where have you been all my life? Um, Nikes. So, God. All right. I just discard the extinction event now, right? Because if they discard a, yeah, they discard a um, a land. I have a mana to do it. They discard a creature. I have blockers for next turn. All right, cool. Blocker, blocker, blocker. And now I'm just gonna play this and just massacre next turn. So, block, block, block. Massacring for one here isn't very good. Yeah, just so you go. I massacre for one. I go to five. And then I can double block. I guess if I have Thalia, then I can't massacre next turn. That's also a thing. Man, what a game. I'm going to like, massacre for one. Thalia makes things awkward. So, so I, this way I just go to five. And now if I double block, I gain another life. And now I get to waste on again next turn too. And have and now my mana is free to sanitarium next turn, not stuck playing massacre next turn. And Dally, of course, makes massacre cost more too, so. We win this game, folks. That'd be that'd be gas. Yes, sweet game. Designed by the magic community. Waste not was the first you make a card card, if I remember correctly. Massacre's big here, obviously. It's a, it's a huge one. In the tank for our opponent. <clears throat> so they're gonna main phase reinforcements and convoke something? Okay. That's not great, but. Is it been already locks it on? Sure. We draw out of the sanitarium. Alright, well. Sanitarium it is, I suppose. 
Oh, you're right. Forgotten, Forgotten Ancient was the first one. I remember that. I was there for that, Gandalf. I was there. All right. Let's just discard Field of Ruin. Let's we'll, we'll, we'll want Sanitarium again. Good catch, folks. I remember that, too. I was there. I was playing Gurren Scourge. All right. Play this. Keep this one. Do it again. Rankle's Prank. It's going away anyway, so... They are getting to loot here. We are, like, giving them a little card selection, which is not ideal, but I think the benefits obviously outweigh the uh, the risks. Good old Forgotten Ancient. Scourge. Basically, our land would be gas, yeah. Getting get to prank them would be pretty insane. Oh, it's really tanking here. Really. It's going all the way. Oh, this, I'm sorry. This goes away. Never mind. Uh, more zombies. And now we just say go. And I have nine zombie tokens. So I think we're in, in the clear here, honestly. With the Massacre in play, too, every trade's good. So there's like, you know, 14 creatures in play right now. So a lot of life lost and a lot of life gained. Shababa, thanks for the raid. Appreciate that. What's up, folks? My name is Jim, Pro Magic player, full-time content creator. Playing a little Explorer slash Pioneer. Uh oh, that's fine though. It's not a matter at all. That has no real bearing on anything. Part-time boss. Yep, trying to be. Uh, I'll hit it for them. This is insane for us. Like, right? So, uh, looks pretty good to me. Uh, basically everything dies, and we gain a bunch and deal a bunch. <laughs> Alright. So, uh, 5-5, five, five, we're high with the Eye Tyrant. Uh, I guess I want the option to keep the card I draw, so let's fire up the Sanitarium. Takanuma. Uh, I'll discard Takanuma. Discard Takanuma. And they discard a land, make a bunch of mana, sure. Alright, let's play as I go. I guess another Imidane's Recruiter here would be pretty tough. It would, still, it would be 6 to be 9, I'd still be alive, but. Alright, down to 5. Damn. Alright. Uh, sanitarium. I tapped many lands. I suck. Come on. Alright, discard this. Alright. Uh, add a bunch of mana. And then we're going to play second sanitarium and just do it again, I guess. I think we might be dead here. Mer, freeze up, thanks so much. Rankle's prank. They just card a non we just card a land here, we just die. Man. We punt. Like. I mean, like, they have to discard a land. Discard a creature? Awesome. So we're good. We're good again. Life's good again. Everything's fine. Fire up hive, attack, exile, whatever. Discard and talk over, over I was bad? Maybe. Like, we don't have, we don't think I'm a Raver to him before, right? Oh, Liliana, right. Yeah, I screwed up. I, I was just looking for creatures. I punted. My bad. Hi, I'm Jim, pro magic player, full time content creator. Welcome to the stream. I was thinking creature, not, not Planeswalker. Good catch. New set is confusing. Uh, just like three old mechanics brought back ten times more confusing. Alright, they're going to Demolition and go wide. That's fine, though. They're just dying to Massacre. Plenty, plenty of blockers in play. And we're still, uh, still Sanitarium-minging. 
Dan, are you going to the RC? We have the whole family going. Uh, we're blocking. <laughs> we we ain't dying, so. Yeah, the whole family's gone. We're bringing, we're bringing everyone. Bring in the house. Alright, so Death Riggers, they lose two. I gain one. And I think we're just good here, right? Like, draw land. Let's fire up Sanitarium. Just Shield's Edict, not very good, but sure. If I play the land, I guarantee activating Hive on their turn if I brick. Um, and Edict's pretty... I'm going to do that. Edict's pretty bad right now, so... That guarantees me two blockers. I discard a land, make a bunch of mana, sure. So let's play this and just say go. If I attack and try and kill them, it doesn't really work. We'll have to block... I gain one. So I don't want to die. I don't want to die. It. I don't want to die to Imidane's recruiser. I can't freaking talk, folks. You're saying it wrong. It's Leviosa. I don't want to die to Imidane's recruiter. Um. But I guess I die to anyway, right? Because I have two blockers and I take six. So if I hive and attack them, they can. They have to block one. I gain one, kill one thing, and then they go to one. I still die to the recruiter. That kind of sucks. Um, they've had so many lands to discard, you know? Any other cards in play besides Imidane Recruiter or uh, Embercleave? Embercleave doesn't really change the math at all. Um, because I would die to that regardless, because it's lethal on any one creature. Two blockers. Take like four, five. Same thing. I'm just going to have to. I don't know if it's right or not. Um, yeah, the LCQ is tough. I agree. Having to like buy your ticket in an LCQ. So they got to block one here. Uh, they're going to be at one, and I'm going to be at six. And I died to Emily the Recruiter. Nothing we can do about it. Is what it is. Um, I think we survive everything else though. And then kill them next turn. So they've played two recruiters so far, and they are halfway through their deck. Oh wow, they're a double block? What? What? Inconceivable! How do you make this block? Oh yeah, I, I still die to recruiter. No, no, because I, I gain life too. That block's insane. Yeah. Just single block and go to one, right? Just try and win the game. You gotta play to win, folks. I can't play to not lose. You gotta play to win. Just block to stay alive and try and draw it and kill me. What else can you do? I got no cards in hand. What a crazy game. Like, we've made like 50 zombies this game. Uh, alright. That's a double block. All right, I think this is uh, I think this is a pretty bad play. Um, by doing this, I go to eight, and there's just no one card that can kill me anymore. And they go to their state four, but and they're really tanking here. Woo! Great time with that follow button on Twitch, Twitch on YouTube. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe. YouTube folks, please take a second if you enjoy the content. If there's any content creator you want to support, right? You enjoy content on, on Twitter or YouTube or TikTok or anywhere. You like what they're doing and want to see more of it, hit the like button. Take a half a second, hit the like button, hit a comment button. Whatever button you can hit for like a half second of your time helps out so much for us full-time content creators. Please do that if you can. They're out of timeouts. This is the last, this is it. This is the last straw. The last rope. And they're going to make the block that I think is going to lose them the game. I don't think this gives them any any outs anymore, so. Alright, so now we're at 8 and they're at 4. And again, no one card kills us. And I just don't know how they ever win the game next turn. Alright, sick. Going to game 3. They had to draw a recruiter, obviously, you know, and in, in to, to win the game if they blocked right. But, got to play the routes, you know. 
All right, so now we are on the draw, which is bad. We have two massacres and a path of peril. All right, yeah, I mean, not great for us, but we'll try our best. That was a crazy game, super crazy game. Well, you know the answer is wrong, but don't want to turn in the blank text test. Yep. Clock sticking. Pen pencils down, please. Blanks of Explorer slash Pioneer on Arena. All right. Um, game three on the draw. Hand is bad. Uh... Very, very bad end. Super, super slow. Pun of mulligans, but if this prank was a massacre or some sort of sweeper, we can keep it. But against them, it sacks two creatures isn't even good, so. Alright, I gotta keep this, so whatever, sure. Turn four, extinction event. Hope it's good enough. Again, not a great matchup for us because a lot of our cards are just dead against them, but. Battlefield Forge Epicure. Extinction event. It's a super, but our worst super against them for sure. They have a lot of odds and evens. Meeting Massacre is the best. We only, we only have two of those, though. Take one. Nothing. Nothing, they say. Uh, Alright. We're going to say go. They have the... The raise the alarm? They do. Alright, so we're going to edict them. Uh, because you want to just not let them convoke if possible, so obviously a pretty terrible exchange, but what can we do? It also kills the odd, leaves you evens in play, so. Do I think this deck, which deck is, is hard to play, Chaz? My opponent's deck or my deck? Epicure number two. Yeah, Extinction Event is much more for Mono Green. This deck seems hard to play, yeah. Alright, so they have a pretty good draw here. Um... We draw Harlow's Act. That was a good draw. Okay, so we can go Harlow's Act to the Loxodon and then hit even next turn. Take a little bit of a shot here. If they have a freaking uh, Emidane's Recruiter, we're in trouble, but we can also gain three uh, in a pinch if we have to. Let's do this uh, pre-combat, I guess. So that it makes the possible cleave cost more. I think they should have boarded out cleave if they have it, honestly. But so they would just cleave on one of these for two mana, so make it a little more expensive. And then we just extinction event whatever they cleave onto. Pulse blank invoke. It's a very very common deck in Pioneer. Nay, reset. Thanks so much. At 11, play a Bunnicorn. Spectre, that sucks. Now they have two and two. God, draw, just draw a Massacre, please. <laughs> I'm going to cantrip this Clinging Dust, I think. I'm trying to draw a Massacre. I'll just target a, whatever, any spell, just draw a card. That is not a Massacre. Okay. Uh, that's pretty nice, actually. We're not going to jam that by itself. I want to cast this on even first. And the next turn, Shieldred plus Fatal Push. It's pretty damn good. All right, so let's, uh, we can't even. They have one card in hand. They have to crack a clue here. So they've got some backup. We're going to kill even. They have a three power in play. Uh, Imidane's Recruiter is still scary, but... They've got, like, probably two giant killers to kill us, and that's it. So, we'll see. Start with the blood's pretty good for us. Discard a land, sure. If we had a Waste Knot in play, those blood discards would be pretty useful. That's kind of the cool thing, too, is Waste Knot actually hits a lot of stuff. If you channel a land, you discard the Fable, triggers on all that stuff, which is really fun. Demolition. All right. That's not ideal. 
Um. Uh-oh. Do they have the, the mutate card? That's not bad, I guess. I have a knight. Uh, that's really good also. Alright. Not ideal. Um, pretty good draw. Or, like, last few cards to have. They have a Bunnicorn and a Reinforcements. Jeez. Alright. We draw Thoughtseize. So we're at 8. We play Shieldred. We probably want to Thoughtseize the Bunnicorn. I could just push it. But then I could push something else, obviously. Extinction Event is very, very good against Mono Green. Whereas Languish is not. We thought he's down to six. We block. Oh, yeah, it's six. Yeah, you're right. I'm sorry. All right, we can't cast Thoughtseize. We're just like, yeah. So, they are putting a lot of stuff in play. Can we cling? Cling requires, what, five cards? It's a lot, yeah. Alright, I mean, they have cards they can draw that kill us. We have some pretty good draws, too. We also have a uh, Hive as a blocker and, like, a pinch. Here's Bunnicorn. Not sure why they're main facing this. What do you got, friend? Really uh, thinking it through here. Oh my god, did you really lock it on? Oh boy. Alright, sure. Um, That's bad. That's really bad for us. That sizes up the knight to a 5-5 five five and also makes them super wide. Alright. Might be Meat of Massacre or Bust here. Um... Extinction Mice also good, man. They're, they're freaking on the clock here, but they're freaking white aggro deck. Let's go. Alright, kill this. We, uh, we need to draw. We need to draw a good spell here. They even have, they even have the, uh, the reinforcements available, too. Rankles? Prankle. That is very bad right now. Uh, it does actual less than nothing. Because we can't sack two creatures, and we can't lose four life, and we can't make them discard two. We're just dead, right? Five. Chump block this, block this. Two, four, six, eight, ten, eleven. Yeah, we're just dead. Wow. That sucks. They had a pretty good draw there. They, 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 they had to put some pretty good uh, pretty good follow-ups. Unfortunately, we should have too many terrible cards in the matchup, realistically. Like, I would love it if Wrangle Sprank wasn't in my deck, but there aren't enough cards to board in. So, tough matchup. Close match, though. It's a fun match. We'll see what they do, but I think we're pretty dead here. We have high to block, but not much else. Reinforcements, yeah. Pretty good draw, honestly. They really recovered from our sweeper, like, really, really well. The Legion's landing. Alright, they got us. Alright, yeah. Tough game. Definitely a hard matchup. Uh, just too many dead cards. Even after ever sideboarding, there's so many cards that are bad against them, so is what it is. Close games, though. Alright, let's try it again. No worries here. Pay him a new Bat God in this deck? I don't know what it is. The new Bat God? What's the new Bat God? Where are they? Ooh, this hand's great. Keep this. Bones on six. Need a double thought. Oh, not again. Are you kidding me? All right. Well, we get to try again, I guess. Thankfully, this time, their hand's pretty trash. Uh, we just take the reinforcements and take the thing next turn. Oh, my God. All right, sure. That's fine. That's fine. Listen, I like a good run back. I love a good salty run back, okay? For those that don't know me, I'm the guy that never quits. I'm not very good, but I'll just wear you down. One time, me and Ross Merriam were at at a bar on Sunday after an SCG 
playing ping pong in the bar. He's much better than me at ping pong. We must have played, I don't know, a dozen games of ping pong for like three hours. He beat me every single game. And I just kept saying again, again, again. Eventually he quit. He was like, I'm not going to play anymore. Now that's me. That's, that's who I am as a person. So let's go. Salty runbacks, you know, let's freaking do it. All right, so they have two lands, a knight errant, and nothing. We're going to pretty happily just, uh, just virtue this, I think. Keep them off convoke. Best of 13, yeah, exactly. Like, if I'm, if I'm playing pickup basketball, and our team is, like, clearly worse than the other team, we lose 6-1, or 7-1, I'm just like, fuck it, run it back, let's go. Let's go, play again. My buddy Jay... My old Pro Tour travel buddy, we used to play tennis together, and I would just wear him out. I'd just be like, play again, play again, play again. He would just get tired. I'd be like, all right. I, either I'll beat him as he's tired, or he's, you know, he's, he just give up. So that's me, in a nutshell. All right, so we're going to just thought these maze mind tome here, I think. Pal, what reset? Thanks so much. Reinforcements. Pretty good, bro. Their hand is land. Okay, so we're gonna go land maze mind tome. All right, this is fine. The Homer Simpson boxing strategy. Exactly. That's it. I'm going to clown college. All right, take two. Play land. They do have a den of the bugbear available, so it's a little scary. Um. I'm going to scry. I think getting to four lives is kind of appealing, so... Castle. Let's bomb that. Alright, so I'm good. Swap. Alright. Um, minusing Liliana here, not particularly appealing. Plusing it, also not particularly appealing. Um, I'm just draw off Tome, I guess. Just start there. Looking for a push or a spell of any kind. Nope. Okay, sure. We can just Edict, I guess. The problem is that they draw, they draw a land of Bugbear. It's like pretty bad, honestly. Should probably actually just Edict now, in case they uh, have a Convoke card. Yeah, that'd be better. Alright. Don't love it, but... Uh, what is this? They gonna cleave me? The old cleave? Could have fielded the den, yeah. Uh that might have been better, yeah. Probably if I just field and then drew. Leave, leave, eat it. Yeah, that's better. I should have done that. Right. Uh, they have Ember Cleave here. It's annoying, but I have Liliana to eat them, which is fine, so. Didn't do it. We got life coming from the dome too, so. Ornithopter. Powerful. Oh, that, that is actually powerful. Sorry. Uh -huh. <laughs> Draw another land. Um, all right. We got to field this den. It's probably just a little Yana Edict, honestly. Just like make them, you know, kill a thing, gain one life. Play and explore. Slash Pioneer. This is my Don't feel good, Don't but again, not a very good matchup for us. Go. A lot of dead cards in our deck, but it is what it is. Definitely a question of do we, do we scry or not? So let's, let's see what they draw. If they draw a good card, we're going to scry. If not, we'll probably just untap and draw. Alright, well they drew a Convoke card. That's bad. Um, yeah, it's pretty good for them. So, take a little look with the Knight. I think we're scrying. <laughs> Desperation Scry coming up. They find Giant Killer and Bunnicorns. The Stone Cold Nuts, uh, Big Threat, and Answer to Shieldred. That's bad for us. Rankles Prank. That's actually kind of gas. Oh, it's Should keep that one, right? Oh my God. I just get to go land 
and then double double kill token double double, double mine rot. Let's see, that's gas. All right, so each player sacks two and then discards two. So both cards in hand gone, and then I just say go. Now at thirteen, they have two creatures, and I have a, a card and four life coming. I guess I'll untap as well. All right, just don't draw uh, Eminem's recruiter, please. That's good, too, I guess, but sure. All right. Runner, runner, knights here looking pretty good, but I think we're okay, honestly. I think us not being dead is a pretty big game, so. They hit inspector and reinforcements. All right, so let's just draw our card. I am also very excited for the return of pressure map. I agree, I love that card. Fatal push. That's not good. Um... We are once again in big trouble. Um, all right, four, eight, nine, ten. Let's draw off the castle, I think. We got fifteen. All right, didn't draw land. No good push targets, so the plan was just try and draw land there. All right, down to five. They are. They have drawn very, very well in the last few turns. Uh, to be totally fair, they're shielded. That helps. That's actually a pretty big game um, with the Heartless Act available too. All right. So you're telling me there's a chance? They've already burned one giant killer. If they have a second giant killer, I'll just bang my head against the wall a few times. So why well, is they have reinforcements? Am I, am I just dead? Hold on. Kill block. We get a one. How about nothing else? Come on! Are you serious? Can you imagine? What? What? Their last four turns have been like a gift from God. Just like, just actual perfects. All right, I guess. Double night into double night, like night into night into exact. All right, all right, I'm done. Show's over. Everybody go home. You don't gotta go home, but you can't stay here. I'm done. I've had. It. I'm tapping out. That's it. Why won't you die? Wow. We were like so ahead too. Like they had nothing. They should stone nothing for like a few for those early turns. Holy moly. All right. Uh, bring in Ray, Path, Extinction Events, and Massacre. And again, we just like... I mean, it just, it just kind of sucks. But, you know, we just don't have anything really bored out. I mean, the go blanks are really bad. Yeah. I mean, Evoke Despair is like... It's pretty bad. But is it just better than... I don't know. Better than what? Like, Liliana or something? I don't think so. I think it's fun. Woo, boy. Chat says our opponent's deck is more consistent than ours. Yeah, I, I think it's like a lot of our cards are just really, really bad against them. You know, like, you know, Liliana eating the facts, terrible against them. Uh, a lot of the discard just isn't great against them. Rankle's Prank, terrible against them. You know, we just have a lot of cards that just are very bad in the matchup. We can't afford to board them all out. We don't have enough room, so. So, like, you know, is what it is. We draw Massacre, we're in great shape. They also, like, they they drew insane that game. Uh, you know, if they brick for, like, one turn, we probably were fine that game. Uh, but they did not, so we died. So, like, that game was really looking pretty good. All right, so on the play, got the Massacre. I'll keep. Got the extinction for the big creatures too. Pulse on the mulligan. What's the new black super?
Massacre's big game here. Big tanks. They're gonna play Deafening Silence. Very good, parents. Okay. Sure. Um. Yeah. Right. Sure. I guess. Very odd. Very very odd. Then they're gonna play Lansiga. Seems like a horrible card against us. I agree. But all right, we're gonna play land, and we're gonna play Liliana and plus it. They probably have to raise the alarm, but it's fine. This also plays really well against the uh, convoke creatures, so that I can I can massacre the small guys and eat, eat, eat the big guys. All right, so we're gonna do this, and we're gonna discard, I guess, a land. It's fatal push actually. The lands are pretty important. They discard a giant killer. They play end step, raise the alarm. So ideally they go like creature, creature, convoke, and we just freaking blow them out of the water. That's the plan. Nothing. Okay. Um, they've already discarded a giant killer. They could have like a like a destroy evil effect. That'd suck. But right, whatever, I'm just playing it. We have Tiger to get it back too, so just take it out. Mana Confluence Wedding Announcement, sure. Works for me. We draw a waste knot. Love it. Alright, play waste knot. Each player discards. You won't be outsmarting me. Discard demolition, draw a card, love it. Gain some life, play this, just say go. Think we're in good shape, folks. I think this game will be okay. Don't want to say we got it all, but we're pretty well rolled up here. Damn. That's aggressive. Alright. Coming out of old Lily here. Alright. I mean, dub announcement's fine. We have Massacre Obviously, They just drew cards, though. Alright, plus this. Scarred Extra Shieldred. Probably just try and kill them, honestly, right? We just, like, fire up the Hive and it's Act for 7. Like. Alright, Shieldred's Edict. Big Boy Dave says, How often do you find yourself buying event tickets? Like on Magic Online? Is that your question? Attack. And, uh... You're at one, I guess? Right? <laughs> 28 to one? Oh, gold? Um, I might spend, like... Like, uh, I spent $100 a set... Like, not every set, but, like, some most sets, you know? I, I also just own every card. It's like, you know, it's a, it's a business write-off, so... About that, I guess. I own, like, every card on the, on the platform, so I'm playing for the entire time. All right, so, uh... Yeah. Mana Confluence. All right, game three. It kind of sucks you made your massacre that game and, like, didn't even need it. Um, and we're really going to need it on the draw here, so... I could, like, put that one in the pocket for next game, you know? Alright. I mean, we gotta keep. We can't all get this. We're gonna keep. Unfortunately, uh, these two cards aren't great against them, but is what it is. Don't have a good draw, please. I do have a thought so Like, I, if they have a really good draw, I can break it up. Vantage. Have it here. Right. Yeah, this is my job. This is what I do for a living. So, uh, buying buying uh, cards on Magic Green is a business expense. Believe it or not. 
There are the tools I need to do my job. They have Imidane's Recruiter, Demolition, Destroy Evil, Thraben Inspector. Uh, Demolition's probably their best card here. Yeah, so they play Inspector, we waste not. Recruiter's like not as scary at this stuff. Play, yeah, sure. You're talking about the demolition, so yeah. You play Waste Knot. Yeah. Play Explore. I'm just tuning in. Welcome. Here's an Inspector. Alright. So. If you even just like land Cast Recruiter. Deafening Silence again? You say so. Alright. I mean... I feel like it's almost better for us than it is for them, right? Because they can't have, like, a crazy Convoke turn, or they can't play, like, Creature into Imidane's Recruiter. Like, this is a really weird card to board in. Like, maybe they're scared of me, like, making a bunch of mana waste on and casting a bunch of spells, I guess, but... They don't have Destroy Evil here, it's fine. Like, this card isn't that important. I, I have Shriel in my hand, so... Oh, non-creature. I'm sorry. I misread the card. My bad. I'm thinking of something else that's not this card. They're going to crack the clue. Leave us a waste knot. Yeah, rule log. That's probably what I'm thinking of. And we draw a thought seize. So, if I thought seize Imidane's recruiter and get a 2 2, it's pretty good. Um, I could also Liliana. Liliana plus isn't the worst. Although, then this recruiter just crack for a million. I'm just gonna thought use them. I can, like, cling on their turn. Maybe. They have a knight also? Alright. I, I I think we, we can play a longer game. I think just dying to this is a way to die. So let's do this. Get, get rid of this. Make a 2-2. Two 2-2 -two. Two is actually, like, pretty big game, honestly. Here's an ornithopter. So they can Ornithopter Convoke here. It's a pretty good turn. I have Rankle's Prank, and I got Shield Alright. So... No Emmys, please. We're gonna draw off Clang, I guess. I get it. We're seeing the, the ineffectiveness of a lot of our cards in the matchup. Like, Prank and Liliana are very, very bad in the matchup. But we just can't board them out. That's what our deck does, so... Getting to prank with Waste Knot in play is pretty cool. They had a Thalia and an Inspector. So if we get the cast prank next turn, it's still pretty good, honestly. So let's just let's, let's draw a card. No land. Not a land. Not a, Come on! We were just saying how bad this card is. Um I put Liliana and I plus it. They'll Well they discard. They discard the thing we draw a card. Awesome. And then Shoulders Live. We discard the Thalia and I get a zombie. It's also pretty good. Alright, let's do that. Liliana plus. You're killing me here. This is my home and I don't drop it. Alright, I get a zombie. Alright, Sega. I mean, they're probably gonna evil the uh the waste not once Thalia well Thalia's dead now so yeah the kind of cool thing with this deck is that like whenever you draw crap you don't need you just discard it obviously like we're playing three sanitariums and you just like discard a sanitarium whatever you know discard a Liana whatever so In the tank. What is this mystery card that you have drawn? All right, Knight Errant attacks me. Pretty sure we take four here. I guess if we double block, it makes the the prank better if we draw land. That's better. I guess do that. Let's block. 
Because now if we we can edict them and then prank them, which is pretty good, so. We're at 12, we draw the land. Alright. So let's start by I plus Liliana. They might destroy evil the waste not in response. Which is like fine, honestly. Let me just play shouldered, so let's do that. Plus this. Okay, discard the extra Liliana. Discard a reinforcements and I make a 2-2. Alright. Man, they're really holding on. Now. Now if I play Shield Rude, they just destroy Evil It. I'm one card short of being able to cling. I don't really want to make each player sack two creatures, because I actually have the best creature in play right now. If I go to discard cards, I'll just kill this, and we'll lose Shieldred. I'm just going to say go. They have a clue and a blood to work with here. <laughs> it's been some pretty tight games, honestly. With cross-platform streaming available, we'll stream to YouTube also. I haven't thought about it, honestly. Okay. Blood is good for us for Waste Not, yes. Here's the clue. Alright. Tight game. Definitely a tight game. Oh, they did it! That shit doesn't matter, but... Uh, and black, black. Draw. Prank store. So I'm gonna draw with the uh, the castle now. And, I, and I'll have two extra mana left over, which is kind of cool, so... Oh, we're gonna castle so hard. This ain't no coward stream. I'll take three, whatever, I don't care. up skip at any cost oh, all right all right oh all right that's pretty good double shoulder too all right let's just plus and start there let's see what happens cast on like in chess exactly discard the prank for the land makes you black okay so, the worst thing that could happen to us is probably like end step, raise the alarm, untap, and Medane's recruiter. It's not even that bad. So, I think we're in pretty good shape. I mean, there's no reason to do this for more than two, right? I can't think of one. Oh, it works! Bingo. Oh, fresh meat. Alright. Now what? Liliana on six? I have 13 life, a waste not, and a massacre, and two shoulders in my hand? I think we got there, folks. I think we did it. Alright, everyone. Chill. There's no point in Lily ulting, because, like, they have their permanence of play. We just can keep blessing it. Our clings on too, for a little extra value. Spectre, yeah, that's fun. Fatal push. All right, so plus Liliana. I think I plan on discarding Fatal push. Don't overthink things. 
Midgard Redeen. I get a zombie. Man, they are they are holding this freaking destroy evil. You know what? Here. There it is. You've been holding it literally to your chest. You know, cross my heart, hope to die. I will never cast this destroy evil. Now you have a target. Are you happy? Now you get to cast it. You happy? I hope you're happy. Next turn I have shoulder and then Liliana ult you, so. Den of the bugbear, sure. Who wants a good Liliana ultimate here? What do you think? Hold it for game four. Wanna ult? If you wanna ult, raise your hand in chat. I need to know. Who wants to ult? And what's the split if we do ult? Probably just like Bugbear Inspector versus everything else. Or Bugbear Inspector. I don't know, something, whatever, if it's figured out. We are the ultimate. I got to have shielded too. <laughs> like. Tough choice. We did it! At core level 5! Puzzle and Survival, thanks so much, you're great. Alright, so. Wait, what? What kind of UI is this? Oh, you choose the numbers. Oh, okay. That kind of makes sense. Um, so. They can have. I like this. Uh, keep all three lands or all of your stuff. Plus bugbear. Don't think it actually matters, but kind of like have to keep the lands here. They should never win. Actually, that, that UI is pretty good, honestly. Well, they, they, like, they usually pull the cards, you put them in a bottle. They're going to keep uh, keep the stuff. All right, sure. Here's Shieldred. GLHF. If only you held on to two Destroy Evils, that might have worked out better for you, you know? Shock. Sure. Fatal Push. Also sure. Uh... Got it all, folks. Somehow, Shieldred returned. Alright, uh... You won't be outsmarting attack. Me. Do this, whatever. F6, your turn. They're really dead. They have no outs. Oh, that's Shieldred, that's cool. So you're at three. One if you clue. They've got nothing. Waste not. 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 <laughs> they cast giant kill. That's pretty funny. Well, it's your giant killer, but uh, yeah. All right, that's that's fine. We'll take we'll take the W. Game. All right, sweet. That was a, that was a long two matches there. Really, jeez. One more match. One more match. Hand is great. I will keep. It's actually insane. So you have Thoughtseize into Tome, into Thoughtseize, Thoughtseize draw. And they're not playing Boros, all right. All right. Sand's actually awesome for us. Underdog. Underdog's pretty good against us, but I think it's fine. All right, so you get to go Maze Mind Tome. They'll actually will just Virtue Thoughtseize next turn, probably. We'll see what they, what they draw, but... So here's, here's Honey Dog. No scries here. We want to draw as many cards as possible, so. I'm going to Thought Seize. Obviously, I only have two unknown cards, but let's do it. And they have Fable Shieldred. Damn. I'm glad I Thought Seized. Um, we kill Shieldred pretty well, right? I can risk that, I think. Yeah, I'll take the Fable. Virtue this. And we got plenty of time to work this maze mine tome. Always Liliana's for his uh, shoulder and stuff, so no scry. Draw waste not. Cool. Let's draw a card. This is just the list that they did well on a, in a League of Magic Online, playing Tome over Bankbuster. It's definitely interesting. You know, obviously Bankbuster is more, you know, more in favor than Tome is in general, but. The extra card matters, the life matters, being able to scribe is kind of cool. You don't really need the threat, you know? It's more of just a card draw engine, so 
I'm not sure exactly. Um, I would think you play Bankbuster, but Mace Mind Tome does make more sense in his deck in a lot of ways. So we obviously didn't take Shieldred. So like they, they're scared we're going to kill it if they jam it. Let's we'll see what they do then. Playing Explorer, Pioneer, and Arena. Just going to jam it. All right, that sucks. Right, we draw. A Sanitarium. Not ideal. We are on a clock now. Obviously, we need to like find an answer here. That's a Duress. Also not an answer. All right. Well, I'd be in trouble here. They have Croxa, too. No, I hands all lands. That sucks. Draw Maze Mind Tome. Okay. That's super awkward with our... Uh, super awkward with our... Uh, shielded problem. Um, I think we need to discard Tome to, to Croxa. It's going to take any damage. So I guess it's We have Sanitarium Waste now, but they have Shielded. So, I mean, I think taking Fable over Shielded is right. We have so many answers to Shielded. Maybe the underdog too. Maybe maybe it wasn't right. I don't know. Now we're just like dead. Yeah, maybe it's wrong. Upkeep scry. Can't afford to draw, so. No, don't want to draw thought sees. Man, we stink. Just total bricks. Brick city over here. Um, they have a push, an underdog, and a Croxa. Yeah. Yeah, I, I think I think the taking fables right. We just bricked off super, super hard. Like, we're drawing to four pushes, a Heartless Act, two Edicts, um, Clink to us as a re redraw, four Lilianas, two Rankle Planks, Four, three of our shield of our own. We're drawing like, like half our deck almost, you know. Draw a castle. Sure. All right. You got it. All right. Here we go. We'll go out on our own terms. Happy? Yeah. We definitely, uh, I think it was correct, but all right, so we're dead. Tough game, honestly, because I obviously it looks really stupid. Just like we could, we just died to the card we could have taken, but I think it was correct. All things considered, uh, but whatever. It's fine. We're going to bring in, uh, let's see. Invoke despair seems pretty good. Um, Kling's pretty good. Duress is pretty good, too. I think the Massacre's not really necessary. And then Go Blank might be a little redundant. That is true. I guess the Waste Knot does neuter, like, the Chapter 2 of Fable. But, yeah, I'm not sure. Alright, um... Why Raven Man? It's like a, like a fine threat against, like, a control deck, you know? Alright, let's try this. I think this is a good matchup for us, too. We just kind of, like, just, you know, bricked and died. Unfortunately, it happens, but... If you're sitting in, folks, my name is Jim, Pro Magic Player, full-time content creator. Hi, how you doing? Welcome. First, hit that follow button. Watching YouTube, make sure you like, comment, subscribe. And, uh, what's up? We got all of our exciting new content stuff coming up. New set coming out. We got freaking 10 new brews. And we got complete set review coming up. We got freaking Pilot Diver pre-release. And... Bronze Mythic, of course. So, lots of cool things happening. One Ring, not legal in Pioneer. Also, folks, download uh, download Puzzles and Survival, please. F try a new game. Supports me monetarily. It's a win-win. It's try a new game and support me, support me for free. Download the game. Alright. Uh, sand is great. I'm going to keep... I go. Previous stream where it's a conversation with chat. Uh, that'd be a bit too noisy, I think. Alright, so we're gonna waste not over Maze Mind Tome, I think. Set up for Go Blank next turn. Bank Buster! We now get to figure out what's better Maze Mind Tome or Bank Buster by putting them up head to head. All right, we're going to blank here. They discard lands and get to cast back and cast home. Excellent. has got some cool stuff in it. The mechanics seem really complicated, but it seems cool so far. Looking forward to 10 new brews as always. They discard creature and spell. So I draw a card and make a zombie. Love it. All right, so you go. Go blank's great. Freaking mine rot, folks. Here's Fable. We have push for the token. Alright, I'll just push this, Mace Mind Tome, play land, so they go. Alright, 
A buddy says, do you know that I actually helped design Waste Not? Yeah, me too. I did too, actually. Come on. Let's get real here. Discard cards, please. Oh, they're gonna do it. They're gonna do it. They're gonna do it. Do it. Draw two. That's how you nerf Fable, folks. You make it so when you discard two, your opponent draws two. You got a shame scoop, maybe? No, should keep playing. All right. Stomp it is. Next turn, we just gonna prank him, right? Just gonna get all the, all the cards in their hand. They shock in. All right, no scars. Untap. Draw Liliana of the Veil. Liliana's also pretty good. We can just Thought Season then Liliana. That's pretty good. Thought Season Liliana Plus. They have Chandra Sokazan. So draw a card off that. And then I Liliana. And I will make two mana off the thing. And then I, I, I get to draw off my, off my tome. It's pretty cool. Rankle's pranking. Each player discard, I discard the duress. You know they discard the land, make two mana, draw off Maze Mind Tome. Having a mana sink for Waste Knot is pretty sick with the Maze Mind Tome. Alright, so there you go. This game's like freaking over. They just have nothing left. Oh, I guess they can Buster Kill Liliana. That's true. Uh. Then I just prank them, right? Just like, I kill both their creatures, get their hand. They're gonna stomp. Liliana. But why? <laughs> Alright, so... That's weird, but sure. Um, they have no cards in hand now. We... I guess we just like... Get let's just draw a card. Actually, well, let's just get shoulder shoulder and play just draw a card. Just draw immediately, just make sure we gain the life. We are like comically ahead on cards here, so they have active reflection, which is a little scary, but I mean I think we're in pretty pretty, pretty decent shape here. Okay. Just the old uh the old no cards in that rip Shelly, but it's fine, I guess. Untap and draw. We draw a swamp. Uh, let's draw again. Alright. Um, now we've drawn Sanitarium, which is kind of cool. We can do that. They have no cards in hand, so... Prank is awkward against Reflection, as are most Edict effects. We draw Cling to Dust, sure. They discard a thing, I draw a card. Anyway, without, without them having shoulder blade, we'd be like gaining a thousand life here, but sure. Um, draw Virtue of Loyalty, good draw. Per right, persistence, good draw. All right, so we can kill the uh, Reflection. They can't do anything profitable with it, which is great. Now we're at 22. So, all in all, feeling pretty good here. If we lose this game, I'll be distraught. Like, distraught. I guess if I draw, like, exactly Doomblade or whatever, some terrain effect, I may just, like, kill this crew attack for 12, we could lose the game, but... We can also return Liliana. We can just like prank too, right? Just like kill two creatures and prank because we have the virtue as well. They're gonna attack with the bone grinder. Oh, that was a block. So they 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 do a stomp here, I guess. And I'll just prank them. Chandra's fine too, sure. So now I just prank and kill their shouldered. I think all that matters is their shoulder dies. That's a really important part. So, uh, so we're gonna tap. We're gonna draw. And two. So we're going to prank and just each player sacks two creatures. And then we're going to start drawing cards, which is fine. So let's go prank. We have the uh, the sanitarium also. 
Each player sacks two creatures. That's it. Format of Kill Shoulder is not the best thing ever, but it's fun. And then we're going to... I think we're going to start by just Sanitary. I'm going to see what happens. Liliana. So we'll discard the extra... Just duress. Discard a creature, get a zombie. It's pretty cool. Play Castle Lockwain. Just say go. We can cling thing if we need to. Yeah, that's great, Golf. Have it here. Bunch of lands for them. Exile top card. It's a fable. Alright, they're still playing. Again, they can't loot off because I have Waste Not in play. So I cast Virtue next turn, probably, anyway. So we have five, six, seven mana. I feel about the Jets. I mean, they're the Jets. You know, they're kind of just doing their Jetty thing. When it, when it, they win, they beat a team they aren't supposed to, lose to everyone else, give fans false hope. Just the Jets. Now let's exile a, uh, a non creature. Probably should have Chandra, honestly, if they can't sack an Uma, whatever. Draw land, no scry. Untap, draw fatal push. Good draw. Actually, a great draw. Um, so now I get to push this, attack Chandra, and then play Virtue. Jets are my team, yes, unfortunately. Um. Uh. Yeah, chump block? That's fine. Two, four, six, eight. So we can go. Yeah, we're just going to play Virtue. Alright. I mean, 20 life. Feeling pretty good here. Will they discard cards and once again allow me to draw off Waste Knot? Or get my, get my, my Waste Knot value? They will not. So Virtue will get a Shieldred. They exile a land. We've got Liliana. Maze Mind Tome. We've got Hives and Castles and Sanitariums. I agree. Castles have been legendary. Back for four, sure. All right. Uh, that's kind of cute. No pro tour for Ixalan, just the end of the season. I'm actually pretty happy there's a bit of a break, so. All right, make a devil. My goons will make quick work of you. Just get discard a swamp. Defy me, and All you right. lose. Let's just get shielded. So, target shielded. Let's target. Yeah, their shielders. They can't talk a nomad. Sure. And then draw field of ruin. All right. Uh, I can't have their castle, which is pretty good. So, let's just start by drawing a card. Let's start there. Let's draw a card. Maybe these hives too. So. Um, we can Hive and Liliana. Let's Liliana them. Yeek to you. No more distractions. Let's make this quick. <gasps> they sacked the Bone Crusher Giant. Damn, they are all in on this freaking uh, this Planeswalkers. All right, fire it up and attack. Or attack, uh, attack here, and then we're gonna try and kill Chandra. I think. Exile, I don't know, whatever. This all feels pretty good to me. They can kill Zombie or Liliana. Sure. Opponent is really, really, they're, they're a grinder, folks. They are, I mean, they are behind on literally every metric this game. All right, they're going to pack it in. I lied. They're not a grinder. Opponent's not a grinder at all. Why won't you die? Uh... All right, so go into game three. Sideboarding stays the same, I think. Yeah, turn it back. Full Pioneer on Arena. I don't know. Hopefully soon. I'm really tired of explaining that Explorer is like just like Pioneer, but, you know, just a little bit different. Um, I don't know. We'll see. Too long is the answer to your question. Too long.
Cons is coming soon. Yeah, I'm not sure when, actually. I'm not sure what the release, release date for that is, but... All right. Um, we're going to keep. It's a little awkward, but we need to draw land. Cons, bronze, and mythic. We'll see when it falls in. It's hard to do bronze mythic for the extra sets because there isn't enough time between the main sets. Ooh, that's a good draw. Chain to the Rock's one of the big misses, yeah. It takes waste not, and I draw a land sick. All right. So now you should have Liliana into, into shield root, so... They have Fable and Lance. All right, this is a massacre. All right, so let's see go. Virtue's nice too to have, to have to build up to, so. It's a waste not, you know, it's kind of rude. Thoughts is again? Right. We have Castle, so. Take Liliana. Cling to dust. Let's start there. I'm gonna draw a card. Draw a card. It's a fatal push. Uh, not fatal pushes, thank you. Pistol push shield root. I'll be so sad. Alright. Man, our opponents really have it out for us today. Alright. This is like the sickest game of all time. They have actual nothing. Works like dead in two turns now. Unbelievable. <sighs> Alright. Uh can thoughts these top of the deck. Yeah, that's true. We draw any land or any Celt card that can kill Shielder, we're in good shape. I can't push Shielder. Nothing on the on my side is died. No! Stop drawing Thoughtseize! Unbelievable. Two mana gain two life. I don't think it's really in the cards. So we're going to be at four. No! Just unbelievable. All right. Yep. I guess we're dead. Um. Yeah, that's uh, it's about as bad as it gets. Uh, it'd be very hard to draw worse than this because their hand was five cards and terrible, and uh, they just played a card that we have a thousand answers to, and just couldn't draw a land or an answer. What are you gonna do? Virtue won't won't matter. We still will die in our upkeep. I'll still be dead at bugbear as well. So we go to six, go to two, die and draw step. Yeah, ends the breaks, I guess. All right, sure. It happens. All right. So, obviously a bummer, but let's take a look at our stats here on untapped.gg and see uh, how it all rolled out. It was a long, a long set of games there, honestly. Those, those Boros games were really long, surprisingly. Uh, let's see here. Hop on over to the old untapped. So you can follow track all your games just like this on untapped.gg. Use my link in chat or description. Hashtag sponsored. I used them well before I was sponsored. Untap's phenomenal. Down it for free. Check all your games. And uh, we went 1-2. Our losses were pretty meh. We lost the Boros deck, which is a pretty bad matchup. Rakdos is actually a really good matchup for this deck, I think. But we just ran colder than, uh, colder than ice. Freeze! Uh, but yeah, this is actually really fun. It's, it's actually pretty awesome that like, Waste Dots actually like a competitively viable card here in uh, 2023. Uh, and again, mostly thanks to Sanitarium. That's, that's, that's the, real, uh, the real draw. But yeah. Uh, deck sweet. Really, really cool deck. Like it a lot. So, YouTube folks, love you. Like, comment, subscribe. You're all great. Peace.